Hey up lads and lasses, how's the doing? Grant to see you. Back. Yes. I'm back with another video. I've got these two. Uh, I got these last week actually. Last week. So, may have bus lad 87. Right. We're going to try these. I've tried these before. Come here. Right. We've probably all seen that are variants of that at some point. It's like mint and peanut butter, which can go down. <laughs> I don't want to hear about peanut butter. Come on. That's it, I think. But that's the plain one. And then they've just released basically what's the opposite way around, which they're calling the Dairy Milk Oreo Sandwich. I'm starting to think Dairy Milk and Oreo are either in a good partnership, or Dairy Milk's making them. There's a lot of Dairy Milk Oreo stuff about now. So, um, we'll open this first and try these, and then we'll crack that one and then compare the differences between them. It's one of them is here. That's cool. I do prefer these ones. Alright, you can. Probably a permanent thing when the weather warms up. Still rocking my beanie. Rest in peace, brother. Not not that it's brother. This beast from the east is here. Yeah. Tell it where to go or not. Yeah, yeah. Wearing this because why not? I actually like the colour. That looks weird. That looks weird. So it's in squares, like that. It has Oreo, let me do the Hamduku. It has an Oreo biscuit in it, but it has a, a full dairy milk bar in the middle of it. It's not cream, it's just literally just the bar. Y'all, is that focused on that? That is weird. I was not expecting, I was expecting, expecting like, like cream on this top. smaller. Yeah. I guess it, it does kind of have a little bit of cream on the, on the top. So there's another one there. So do you try? There's more cream on that one. It looks very, very good. I just want to see the actual bar itself. I just want to know what the shape of it was in that. It's just literally that. This is a blowy on bits of Oreo inside the bar, so you can't really see. There's some tiny ass chunks. Yeah, it's like a creature. Yes. So that's like the normal bar. It says Cadbury's on it. You just about see the, uh, the bits of Oreo on this side. Biscuit to this, but well, it's more Oreo inside. Yeah, but I've got like the cream and the bits of Oreo biscuit, whereas this one has like a full mini Oreo stuck to the bar. But both are equally nice, it's nice to have the variety. I 
have an, an idea of the sizes of the chunks as well. Last time I this chunk. Yeah. That's that's more beer milk taste rather than that. Yeah, I thought that. Milk taste in the Oreo bit. Mm. But uh, I don't know which one I prefer to be quite honest. Because they're both pretty much the same. Opinions? I can just the oil on the mm. stuff. Not the mouth. That's the same, but that's the same milk taste. Just with an Oreo biscuit. Yes. I, I don't know which one. I do like them both though. Uh, I think I paid for me some Pe stupid price for it. Definitely. Uh, all your taste. This one, this one. Mm. So, yeah, so, I prefer these ones. Yeah, the bits of yeah, they are too much sometimes. <laughs> I, think, I think I paid so much silly like £1.33 for the sandwich. And like a pound twenty for the for the normal bar, or not even a pound in my sense. You could probably get both for a pound if you look around. That one and take to the right. So, so yeah, so this to the side. So we can later. Uh, by the time you guys get to see this, which probably should be on the day that I. Um, in a few days, isn't it? Yeah, it's like that. So, like, got this. So, it's been coming up to a year since this beast came out. Ooh! I mean, I got some new colour. Yeah, there's, there's a new colour there. I do have the other one that goes to that side, but it's on my joy con grip. And it's got the, the red one that went with this originally. So, there's, there's the yellow and the red, which looks like fire. And then, um, these colours. But, yeah, so, you'll be a year old already. I remember queuing up over there at half ten on the night before your launch, you know, before anybody else in Leeds turned up. Yeah, I was the first person this week. When you were someone else? I'm like, yeah, we well, were with uh, Dick and Liv. But they didn't get one back there. Nick got, Nick got his uh, later. Yes, it's two weeks after it came out. Excuse so, me? So, can have a look at that. So I got you a nice little Christmas present, you know, I think that this was one of them. And I can't remember what the other one was, it might, might be the joy con actually. So, for your birthday, you know, because I'm nice, I'm nice that right? night. This has only just come out. It is a joy con and pro controller charging dock. So, as you can see, you, you, you pop your pro controller on the front, the thing comes down, sits into there, and on the dust. The joy on the side. So I need to find something to pop that up and when it has the can I just pop it? What a shit bit of tea. Oh, that's a well never mind. It just <laughs> broke in. Oh, that was just terrible. Terrible black security. Oh god. <laughs> is that what I think it is? Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> is, is that, that what, what I think it is? was? Yes. I am manual. not shaking your hand now. <laughs> it's usually manual. I love switch box designs, like they do little close ups of Ooh. stuff. That is nice. Oh like the, the blue the blue blue on this side is nice. Right. Twenty five ninety nine if anybody wants to buy from here. <laughs> Which is about the same price online as well. Do you want any batteries or anything? Probably not. No, don't think. Hey, you got a light. Don't mind. Uh, let's see, it charges two Joy-Con and one Pro Controller. Each sliding design Hi, connects each Joy-Con. I've got a question for you. Why are you covering my husband's face up? I'm here. <laughs> so, so, so. <laughs> you must be to see us. Yeah. I like that it includes the USB. Three individual LED lights, you know, for each joystick and whatnot. 
weighted base. Okay. Shit, no one cares about it. Just a plastic. An attachment. Goes on to it. I think you might need this. Oh, right, okay. I, I have a cable. Attached to another cable. Because, because it's not detachable. That, you, you don't get a choice for that. How can they say it's USB C then? I, I guess the. The, the actual. Part, but like, it goes this way. No, the port is there. There. Hang on, hang on. That's, I just realised that it goes. Come on. Oh yeah, that reminds me. So, we saw your video for about the new sweets a few weeks ago. Yeah. Hi, Brad. I'm listening. New sweets? Yes. I think it was the Tropical the Tropical Maynards. Oh, Jolly Babies. Yes. I actually, got to, I actually got to try them last week. Right. And I definitely tasted the pineapple. That wasn't nice. You can only just taste the mango. Oh, yes. And I think it was the banana you could just taste. Shit on it. I, I don't know if that is what you yes, was thinking or what you said, but that's what I. Yeah. But well, that's what I've worked yeah. out. I was looking at the length of the wire anyway, which isn't very long. No. It's your feet. It looks like a little, like a little baby pinball machine or something. A little. I don't know. What the pinball wizard? Arcade game. So have a look at the size. Look at the looks, it it looks look? tiny. Turn it on its. I should probably like show you guys what this looks like instead of faffing around with it. Your, jo your pro controller sits on the front there. Joy cons sitting on the side. That side. The lights on the top. To indicate which one's which. Nothing on the back. And some strange arrangements of stuff on the bottom. Button. I like clicking buttons. Yeah. And this is just a, that, that slits in there. Slits, slots. How? There it is. Is that what thing we're shiny for? Oh, come on, give me that. I'll give you that. Stuff will be sticking to me today. Okay, so. Is it that really sticky stuff that's not actually sticky? Yeah, probably. It's yeah, really it's sticky stuff. Stick, yeah. You look like you should slot in or click in because, because, because reasons. You do not. Try going the other way. Refer to that thing. I don't want Try to the it. other way. No, because it needs to go that way. So it fits in. That's some, do us a favour. Have a check of it. Because they don't want to touch it. That's just some service. Ah, here we go. It don't come with anything else. Mm. Ah, there you go. That's just some service. Alright, you can. Oh, okay, you can plug. Oh, yeah, gosh, because it's got USB. Yeah, the... it has that on it. Oh, right, okay. It doesn't even attach to this. What you gotta do, you attach it to this. And that sits in there, and that sits nice and snug. Let me de dust it so I can make it look pretty cool. Yep. To let you know, you're on the almost 14 and a half minutes. Nice. So that, yeah, looks like summer. That is your charging cell, yeah, which will do for me for my other Joy-Con as well. Plug into your switch fingers. Yeah. Like. So obviously, if, when the switch itself is plugged in, and you got these on, these charge up. So my other set can sit on this, and that can sit on the front of my car. So you've only got, you can only charge one set of Joy-Cons per time. Yeah. Okay. You've got no charger, but you've got. 
You can charge it off there whilst it's charging, yeah. Yeah. Got another charger top as well. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you can buy a separate Joy-Con. It's basically just this bit without the front bit. I think you can put four Joy-Con on all together. So, yeah, that's nice. So, what am I doing now? Take these. Because I'm going to show you. One year on, what is on my Nintendo Switch? Do I have a few of them? Do that. Do this. Let's see if I can pop the kickstand out without, like, without the use of equipment. Also, we're in the car. Yeah, it's been a while since I sat in this seat with the non sponsored signage around me, with the non sponsored <laughs> shop behind me. <laughs> then money. Reflections and shit. Screen right there. It's rocket to max. That's nice. Okay. So that's my home screen. Let me, uh. Nice. Okay. There you go. There's uh, Nanko Museum Pac Man. That's basically a free download, but you can get the game as well. Um, you have to pay for that separately, of course. This allows you to play multiplayer with other people, so you have people that actually have the game. I've yet to get the game. But I thought that that would be something cool to have. It's in on the bar somewhere. Like so, yeah, I've got that. Uh, I've got pinball. Um, at the moment, I only have one table accessible, but I do have a bunch of others which all come in different packs. Um, no, I don't care about the internet right now. Or you can load. So I've got pinball. Um, you're probably going to laugh at the name of the pinball table that I have ready. Like you've got one ready to go table. It's called Frankenstein. <laughs> uh, who, who, who comes to mind uh, when, when you think of that name? Those, those that know us locally. There you go, Frankenstein. Based off the uh, the original movie, I think it was. It gives you when you load the you know when you go into it and you load it, it gives you a little description before the table comes up. Anyway, close that. Of course, I've got Mario Odyssey, which uh, I played through the game and beat it. I just need to finish collecting moons and shit. Minecraft, which you all have seen a couple of gameplays on. That's a brand new game, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. I've yet to play that. I'm probably pretty <laughs> shit at it. Sonic Mania, again, a brand new game. I'm probably pretty shit at it. Launch title game, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Fantastic game. I'm probably pretty shit at it. 36 Fragments of Midnight. Now, I saw this on the eShop and... Um, Basically, it was like £2.47. So I thought, I fancy something a bit different. I'll give it a go. Yeah, I'll pay for it. And uh, Basically, you, you just play through a level and you, and you, you beat the game. But like, you've you, you got to have patience of a saint to get around. There's, di there's different level designs that it randomly selects. But, um, like, you, you, you're this little cube thing and you've got to like jump over obstacles and dangerous stuff. And, like... A plus. How, how are you supposed to be able to tell that's a plot? It doesn't even look like you Press the start. I don't know. Anyway, so, so there I am, look, that's me. So, so you got to go around and collect these things. So like, there's a saw there, you got to like, not touch that. See, I died. That, that's <laughs> the best. I, I, I beat it once. You killed yourself. I, I raged the fuck out. After all the attempts I tried to beat that thing. But anyway, yeah, that's that. There's Pure Pure Tetris. That's quite fun to play now and again. Especially if you've got somebody else to play as well. 
uh, and Sonic Forces I have as well uh, on the Switch version. I do believe you have it as well. I have, I I have both Sonic Mania and Sonic Forces on the PS4. I have not played Sonic Forces yet, but I will play it at some point. I'd give it a go. Yeah, you give it a go on my PS4 and play with your Switch. Yeah, that'd be quite good, that little comparison with the two. And Sonic Mania as well. Yes. Um, we've not seen anybody who's got the Xbox version of either, but. Yeah, yeah, and what's, persuasion. what's on my PS4 late this year is Spyro Remastered as well. I'm yes. looking forward to that. That is a dream come true. <laughs> so you might see so play that. Here's all my screenshots. They have now added the video capture into it. All you have to do is hold the screenshot button and it records approximately 30 seconds previous to you pressing the button. So here's some screenshots and some fun look things that I've made. So there's like the black and white. New Donk City, I have a little, I was going to zoom that one, I set up the Mario down there, I got a little room that I've already collected. Are you a bit hungry, so plus I like seven? Are you nicking chocolate? Yeah. There's a colour version. There's loads of different photos in the game. There's a bit of Mario Kart footage, this is the sort of video you get. This Mario? Yeah. What's better back up than that one? You're pushing 22 minutes off. What, three minutes left? There you go. Who can drift that long? What the fuck is that? <laughs> but anyway, so... I have 710 screenshots and videos. I can actually filter that down. 674 screenshots. 36 videos. I have a lot. A lot of Mario Kart. A lot of Mario Odyssey. Let me show you one thing. Before I sign out. Okay, so I do that. Let, let's watch, watch that can. Oh shit, I pressed the wrong button. Right. Can I, I don't know why. Okay. Watch that paint can. I mean, this doesn't really have a slow mo, but I can kind of skip it a little bit at a time. Where's it gone? There it is. Watch that paint can. Right there. Right, I was just running around aimlessly. Trying to find moons, but like that paint can I kick it. Oh shit! I'll just I'll play it one more time. But just watch that paint can. That's not a shot. I don't know what is. What the fuck is that? By the way, I have beef with gravity. Yeah. Anyway. So yeah, that's what's on my Nintendo Switch one year on. There are more games coming later this year. Uh, there's a Yoshi game coming out. Whenever they didn't announce it in the direct. Uh, there's a new Kirby game coming out, I might give that a go. A uh, new Metroid game coming out, I'm packed as fuck for that. Uh, I can't really think of anything else. But uh, yeah, whatever new games, I'll let you guys know. Hopefully, do some gameplays. So, with all that, wrap it up. Thanks for joining. Yep. Thanks for I trying out new chocolates. New chocolates. Give them a try, they are quite nice. Thank you, Switchy. I appreciate your birthday present. Yeah, check out my channel as well. Yes, I'll put a link. If y'all want to see, because we've just done another test test of that. If y'all want to see that, I'll put a link in the description to the video we've just done of that. Um, we didn't try them individually. So, that said, hi, man. Alright, so as I was packing all the stuff away, I had to like re unpack it because I had stumbled across two things I was supposed to have shown you. Three if you count that. Shit out, I stumbled across these two items which I thought had rest in peace. But um, one of them is a PS3 controller, which is a bit random because I don't own anything past a PS2. But uh, with a lot of magic, I can get that to work on my Switch. All being well. 
and I think it's dead. It should be dead. Like, but like, works now. It's in very good condition. May have that part. I don't know what part that is, but I've probably got that. That's the so. micro, but it looks like it's the printer one. It kind of looks like my Wii U Pro controls part. But yeah, I have a that. So it's very really light as well. I think you have beefier stuff in, but yeah, you're, you're definitely heavier and beefier than, than, than you. And the other thing, right, you're ready for a huge blast from the past. I also came across a that. Like, I, I literally thought that had rest in peace. I thought that thing had gone. Um, I presume everything still works. I did have Super Mario Bros. 3 for this, which is probably that probably definitely rest in peace now. Uh, I think this has the colour display, if I remember correctly. Can't just slot and top. I, like, I fairly remember having this. Um, if anybody know what batteries this takes, please tell me. Uh, doubles, I think. But there's two of them in there and I, I can barely get the cover off. But yeah, I, I've got that. So I'm probably going to start collecting Game Boy stuff now following the, the last video with like the, re the original Game Boy merch. I'm probably going to have to buy some Game Boy stuff now. But yeah, I have that. I'm going to try and get some games for it and get it working again. But yeah, I, should, I meant to add that in. So this time, like for reals this time. Okay, I'll let, I'll let you all have a look. Is that an Ethernet port in the back? Is that an Ethernet port? I think it might. To, no. To connect it to like other consoles and that for multiplayers. That's a bit too small for me. That's not the Ethernet port. A bit too small. That's not the Ethernet port. It's a. It's an external. You're helpful. It's an, it's an external, but it's not the Ethernet port because they're a bit bigger. On, They're about the size of your you. thumb. Yeah, like everything works on it. Yeah, because there's a little line on it there. A little thick one. Is it, it's not the Wii U, is it? No, it's not, it's not the Wii U one. That's like a... That's very odd. Wii U one looks like... No! Ignore me. Anyway. I'm getting this thing working, people. Alright? Well, yeah, I'm done. Is it dead? I don't think there are any batteries in it. But uh, yeah. I can't believe I found that. <laughs> I am glad. Yeah. So. For reals. Hi, Plaid. Ow. <laughs>